moving on from a very sunny Cape Town in South Africa. For all of you that already follow me, welcome back to my channel. And for those of you that are new, welcome and please like and subscribe if you don't already do so. So we arrived here in this gorgeous, gorgeous little cute Airbnb about an hour ago now. We've just unpacked and got ourselves organised and then we're going to very quickly nip to the local supermarket to fill up the cupboards and the fridge with lots of fruit and drink and the most important thing on holiday, wine. We're probably going to head down, get a little bit of food because we're absolutely starving at just a local restaurant. And then tonight we plan on heading down to the seafront to watch the sunset and have some nice food and cocktails and have quite a chill first night in Cape Town. So the itinerary for the rest of the trip, we have a few definites that we want to do. We definitely want to go to Golders Beach and see the penguins. So I think we might be doing that tomorrow. And then I've been recommended a really nice restaurant called Pangea. So we might head down after the beach. It's saying that Boulder Beach is about an hour away in a taxi, but taxis over here are super, super cheap. I think for an hour in a taxi, it costs about £20. So yeah, really, really good value over here. So rest of the things that we definitely want to do, I'd like to go to the Botanical Gardens. I think it's Kirsten Bosch, something like that. Might have got that wrong, but yes, beautiful big garden. I imagine it's something like South Africa's answer to the National Trust. So I'd really like to go and see that and Tabletop Mountain. You can climb Tabletop Mountain from this park. So very excited to do that. Also Safari, big, big, big fan of doing a safari. There's a park here called the Aquila Safari Park, which we've already looked at and seems quite reasonably priced. I think it's about 120 pounds for a full day of safari. And that entails someone coming to pick you up from where we're staying. Then it's about a two hour drive to the safari. I think it's four hours of safari with lunch and travel back. So I think again, that's really, really reasonable. One more thing, Lion's Head, love to get up early one day and climb up there. And then other than that, I think we're just gonna explore, see what there is, maybe do a pool day somewhere, research a nice hotel that we can do a nice pool day and chill because we're here for seven days in total. It was a day of travel either side. So yeah, seven nights in total in Cape Town. Yeah, I hope you enjoy my video. I can't wait to take you all around Cape Town, exploring with us. And yeah, if you have any questions once this is posted, then just ask me. Enjoy! First stop. Two cheese. <laughs> so we've got feto and ava salad. And then we've got tuna tacos and chicken tacos. And I think these were like six pound each. These were like eight pound each, just crazy. So yum, yum. <laughs> Spot for a picky. <laughs> Baptiste. Welcome to Boulder's Beach. Oh. <laughs> Yum, yum, yum. 
Oh, okay, I'm going, we're doing it, we're doing it. Oh, there you go. There's our little penguins. Having a little sunbathe. They look very chilled. You swim. Mm -hmm. After being the penguins all day, we have come now down to the bay again, right where we were last night, um, at a place that we met and ended called. Paranja, so it looks lovely. Here is the view out on the front. So, yeah, just ordered some truffle pasta, first drink of the day, gonna have a GT and chill for the evening. having a quick coffee from the next door coffee shop to our hotel two oat coffees to go and i think this mountain up here is where we're going to be hiking to today we're going to get a taxi to somewhere called i think it's the botanical garden we're going to do the i think it's the skeletal skeleton route up to um tabletop mountain about which is about four hours so so we're going on a big hike this morning, we're going to go to Tabletop Mountain. We're ready to go, we're going to pack the bag, we're going to take the essentials. So we've got backpack, two bottles of water I think, fruit, very important, just some snacks. We're going to stop off at the shop and get some toasties as well. First aid kit, it's giving responsible, it's giving safety. <laughs> and what else have we got? Toilet roll, because you just never know. And what else have we got? Rehydration treatment and sun cream. So yes, I think we're ready, let's go. Welcome to the Botanical Gardens. Let's begin the adventure. Yep, in the side bit. Got my mama. research what to do in the case of snakes because what, we are... <laughs> what does it say <laughs> don't panic <laughs> don't crowd it don't crowd the snakes keep still but the way silly and calm get out never get out of the way so that you can go yeah. so we've decided not to do the big hike today because when we've got here the garden itself is so big and beautiful and there's so many different paths as well going all the way around it there's just so much to take in so we'd rather also do it with a tour guide because it looks quite dangerous and there's obviously lots of kind of twists and turns and it's not signposted and things like that so yeah we're gonna we're gonna come back in another day and do the mountain top climb because i think it's going to be about four hours so it can be quite dangerous as well when the um the clouds come across you've got to be off the mountain by then so yeah we're just gonna uh, enjoy ourselves today and have an explore <laughs> there's like a little rickety bridge down here Yeah. 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 Yeah.
this is very cute, isn't it? Imagine how nice it'd be if it's a little sunshine. Oh no. Wow, have you seen all the decor inside? Amazing. Wow. So this is called the Moyo, I think. The Moyo restaurant. Beautiful. Cheesy oniony. So we've just arrived at the Grand Pavilion for dinner. We've been recommended this by someone that we know. So let's see if it's worth the hype. Mm. Brought as a show. market for a little bit around and actually it's absolutely gorgeous morning so we are off to lion's head this morning um apparently it's about an hour and a half up the mountain and then an hour back down so it's half past nine here we got up a little bit earlier today um just gonna go on the coffee run get us some oat coffees and yeah then i guess we'll be off gotcha wowie so just got to the base of Lion's Head. As far as we're gonna go, there is some more kind of like ladders and it's like rock handles. Um, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna it's very very busy today, so we're not gonna do that last little bit. We're gonna uh, we're gonna head down now. We'll just look at these views. How amazing is that? Absolutely beautiful. This little place we found. So all the nicest kind of bars are all stacked on top of each other. This one's called Chinchilla. So we've got some drinks menus, obviously we've got the cocktails and the food, which I've not had a chance to have a nosy at yet. So I think we're going to have some lights because we're going to go for dinner somewhere um, quite early tonight. So yeah, we've just come fresh from the mountain hike. Um, still in our sportswear. So cool. Let's go shopping and maybe then 
on a safari day trip. So we got picked up before from the hotel, from the Airbnb, sorry. And we have just stopped. We've been driving for an hour now. We've just stopped at a local petrol station. So have a little break for an hour because it's like a two hour, two hour trip to the safari. So um, yeah, just stopped for some coffees. And um, yeah, but one more hour. So I'm very excited for today. Um, Love a day trip and obviously we've not done any kind of other excursions yet so very excited even even the end um, the petrol station here looks amazing so it's like so open plan and uh yeah looks like we're in the middle of nowhere so excited for today see you soon for your picking size on that far in bands welcome to Aquila little welcome drinks Cheers to being here. Aquila Private Game Reserve. Mm, wow. This is beautiful. So we're gonna have some lunch and then safari starts in an hour. are giving birth. They always give birth while standing like this. Awesome. The yeah. reason why they have to give birth standing is because the whole pregnant period, we are talking about 15 and a half to 16 months, the baby will be using his or her mother's heart. So the baby's heart will only be able to start pumping from the middle of birth because she has to drop the baby down so that when the baby touches the ground, that impact will trigger the heart of the baby to start functioning. If she drops the baby down and the baby doesn't respond, she will kick that baby. If the baby doesn't respond to a kick, then it means the baby is not alive. And just one kick of a giraffe, ten times stronger than a kick of a zebra. They are called Elan. 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 Why? Because their lips are, as you can see, they are wide. So it's a wide lip rhino, not white as in white in color. They are very stubborn. They are very stubborn and they are very aggressive. They are very aggressive. <laughs> 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 between an African and Asian elephants are those ears. We've just stopped off halfway for like there's another little wine shack behind me um, and it seems to be like lots of kind of little huts where people I'm guessing you can come and stay um, overnight or kind of in one of their little lodges so yeah there's quite a few other buses that have arrived at doing the same thing so we're just going to have a glass of wine and try and find some shade because it is absolutely scorching hot so i definitely wore the right idea with these 
loose trousers. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get back on the bus and carry on for the second half of the uh, safari. Off we go again! <laughs> Not dangerous. This one coming from there. So it is the last morning here in Cape Town. So I've just gone and got us some more nice oat coffees because we're just checking out now. We've just cleaned up the Airbnb. We're meant to be out about five minutes, but the cleaner hasn't arrived just yet. So we're just gonna have a coffee on the balcony and chill before we're gonna head to a pool for the day. We're gonna book there, um, you know, like just pay for kind of access to the pool and spa in a, like a local hotel because we need some time to kind of chill and um, yeah, get showered, I guess, later before we go um, to the airport because our flight's at seven, so. Also, we're gonna attempt to have a workout in the hotel because I feel like we need a little bit of a exercise. <laughs> 